Each year, about 157,000 people die of lung cancer, the deadliest cancer among men and women, usually because patients with lung cancer aren't symptomatic until it's too late to save their lives. So the theory is if you can find a lung cancer in its earliest stage in a small form and possibly treat it or remove it, then there would be a very high, uh, a higher likelihood of curing it. Improved chances thanks to a promising new screening procedure offered at University Hospital's Seidemann Cancer Center. With low dose CT scan, uh, relatively lower doses of radiation are used, so it is a safe way uh, of screening and picking up lung cancers early. Take a look at these two images. On the left is a chest x-ray, the right a CT scan, both taken from the same patient. Notice how the x-ray shows a clear image, but the CT scan picks up the malignant tumor. The amount of detail we're able to get is much better, and not only the detail is better, but the speed in which we can be able to look at that detail is also incredibly improved. Overwhelming results from a national study showed that using CT scans as a screening method reduced the risk of dying from lung cancer by 20% in middle-aged and elderly patients who are heavy smokers. Up to this point, there are very few interventions that we've seen that will definitely demonstrate an improvement in survival. Similar to the benefits mammography has provided to breast cancer, physicians say CT scans for screening some lung cancer patients is the new hope needed to help save lives.